Hi, I'm Benjamin Rothermel with the firm Benjamin C. Rothermel Esquire. And I'm Connor Ducard. I'm an associate with the firm. Today, we'll be talking about protecting intellectual property with non-disclosure agreements, confidentiality agreements, and non-compete agreements. Intellectual property can be protected in a number of ways. The, um, the main methods of IP protection are obtaining copyrights, um, trademarks, which cover branding, and patents, which cover inventions. Uh, but you can also use contracts to protect IP in a couple of ways. So Ben, what's an example uh, of using contracts to protect IP? Well, for example, say you're a business owner and you sell pasta strainers online. And you've been doing this for a number of years and you have a customer list. Well, you want to increase your business and so you decide to hire a marketing professional, a vendor. Well, in order to make the most use of that vendor, you need to disclose your customer list to them. So you may want to protect that customer list because it creates value in your business. Likewise, you may need to hire employees to help you in the sales and distribution and grow your business. But likewise, you would need to disclose your um, customer list and other valuable secret business information to those employees. So along those lines, there are uh, two IP related issues that uh, can typically be protected with contracts. One is protecting confidential information. Um, and that's usually done by using an NDA, a non-disclosure agreement, um, which is also known as a confidentiality agreement. And so that protects your information. Uh, you can also protect yourself from competition to some degree by using a non-compete clause in your employment agreements with your employees. So overall, these are intended to protect the important secret business information that confers a um, competitive advantage to your business. Now, there's some overlap as Connor mentioned, between these terms and these types of agreements. But overall, there's this general goal of protecting the secret information. Um, you would want to consider speaking with a attorney that specializes in contract law because there are particular elements to these agreements that you're going to want to make sure are um, correct in order to have the best agreement. So if you want to discuss um, contract-based intellectual property protection, such as non-disclosure agreements, confidentiality agreements, and non-competes, please feel free to contact us for, to set up a free initial consultation. Thank you.